very warm welcome to you on uh, this most pleasantly clear evening. As you can see, we are getting through the uh, pre-match formalities and processes, the uh, players coming onto the field for the usual fanfare and handshakes and so on. Conditions absolutely perfect, temperatures are kind enough, it is an absolute picture under the floodlights here and the match that follows ought to follow suit. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. It does appear that they are lining up, Jim, in a 5-4-1 formation. Well, it could be a disguise, Peter, for something else. And that five at the back can easily produce wing-backs. If that's the case, I think, you know, it might end up a three at times. Uh, admittedly, though, if they do play deeper and in line with the centre-backs, then we can um, take it that they don't really want to give much away. That will be foremost in their minds. But essentially... It depends on the two wide players in that defence. If they push on a little bit more, we could see something very different. So off we go then. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? I would think Son Young Min, the South Korean. He can play anywhere in attack, but ideally his, his most success seems to come from wide and his incisive inward bursts. He may not yet be regarded as a great goal scorer, but he has real ambition to get there. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. Musa Sissoko. Now it's Sissoko in towards the middle. Gets up to head it! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Hoylert, Eriksson gets it back. Eriksson very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. He's got away. Oh, that's nice. Bruno Equelmanga comes out on top in a really physical duel. And it's Davis. Over to the left. Son Kyung Min spreads it towards the left. He's in. Is it in? There it is! The first touch was absolutely heavenly, and because of it, the finish was a mere formality. Tottenham go ahead, one goal to the good. Reed. Hoylert tries to dig a spectacular effort. Oh, that was extravagant by any standard. Reed certainly showed brilliant imagination there to take on such a high tower of skill. Usa Sissoko. Trippier. Ali. So who's he picking out? Can he deliver? Trippier crosses it. Hits one!
that's been lever clear. Reed plotting from out on the right hand side. That's great strength on the ball. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Crosses in a low one. That's gone a long way up and away. And it's Bennett. Lobs it in. Great leap! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Kane. Davis has come steaming up from the back for this. Played into space out wide. And he just whacks it away. Trippier. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Winks. Eriksson plays it forward. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Cut out in the nick of time. And he heaves it forward. Trippier. Musa Sissoko. Now a chance to break. Deftly done. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Trippier. Keeper's got good distance on that. Aldevero goes looking. Deli Alley played out to the right. And it's Sissoko. Surely gets good distance on it. And the shot! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Reed pushes it out wide. Reed. And the whistle goes for half time. And there we are, off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. It hasn't exactly got the plan so far, but there's no need to panic. There's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. Here we go again, then. Cardiff don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Stitch defending, but that'll do. Dashing forward at pace. Davis battles to win it back. Vertonghen. Trippier. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Looks to clip it forward. And the defence can get it clear. Sissoko can hoist it clear. And he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick.
Morrison. Kane with good energy in defence as well. You have to admire a commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Keeper goes long. And it's Ericsson. Tottenham uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Stuck out a leg for a good challenge. Cardiff can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Deli Alley. Ericsson. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. Here it comes. Son Kyung Min, he's onside. Well, Red, he's sorted that out. It's hoisted clear. Greed. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Now it's Kane. Now it's Ali. Aimed long and direct. Arta. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Tottenham have a free kick. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. And it's Kane. Dicks one in. Looking for space out wide. Fine defending there. Boylet looking to get on the end of this. Up to meet it! Should have equalised. I think he rushed that. He had a bit more time than he realised. He could so easily have equalised there. Davis. Ericsson. Musa Sissoko. Winks, he's got options out wide, he's left his man. Tottenham Hotspur are looking to make this one safe, they want to reduce the risk. Keep calm and carry on, that's the job in a nutshell now. to the last five minutes. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Hoylert. Arta. Tries to cross. Massive leap! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross.
And it's Sissoko. Sissoko plays it long. It's got through to him. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. And time is up. So it ends 1-0, an enthralling game and an agonisingly narrow defeat. Well, the way the manager has stormed down the tunnel lends itself to an almighty telling off for such a, a timid, docile display. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.